perhaps Samoa held him up. No, there is the ball for England. Gollings, Rodwell. Does Rodwell have the stride? Brilliant tackle. Barden is there. He'll need to go as close to the post as he can. It is 12 all. <laughs> ben Gollings. Will he have struck a more important conversion? Possibly as far as New Zealand are concerned. Oh, it's off the woodwork. Just like Lola Louis before him. It is a matter of millimetres. And now we will have extra time. Thank you. Otto, Samoa, the last seven seconds of this second period of extra time. Royal makes amends by making the tackle. Samoa oh! have another penalty oh! right on the hooter. Now, we will continue to play periods of five minutes until somebody scores. This is incredible. Professional foul, England are down to six. Stay here. This is the drama, Lola Louis. If he gets this, Samoa win the World Series. It's there, and the title is with Samoa. They have beaten England here. They have reached the final, but more importantly, they have won the series. Well, if you're standing at home, wherever you're watching this, stand up and applaud this magnificent effort from the side. This has been... Wellsby, Bateman, forward pass. That it was, is huge. Again, they've offered Samoa another excellent position it here. It was a forward pass, Dave, it was a forward pass. Four tackles for Samoa, England will be hoping for a mistake. Luai, back it comes to Pailihi, Pabalihi now, put on the ground, England slowing it down, have a look for Milford, Milford again is in position, but they're also going to go back to Crichton, Crichton's got time to try and win it for Samoa, and Stephen Crichton is a history maker! Samoa into the final of the Rugby League World Cup. What a moment for Rugby League. What a moment for that nation. And in amongst it, what a moment for Stephen Crichton. English hearts are broken. It's not going to be a home nation success this year. But Samoa have just written a huge chapter in the history of international rugby league but they've done it at the expense of england the yeah, heartbreak for england in the last 20 minutes of that second half they came to life they dragged themselves back they got in the game oh, they're absolutely gutted gutted oh they put it on a plate but what a kick from stephen Crichton! hasn't he stepped up in this match to score the try and then drop the goal you just got to feel England have handed it on a player, a forward pass and a drop ball to start the extra time. Devastated. Player of the match, I think you two. Zane Davis will bounce in field. Short on numbers. That's the full time siren. Lost. And for some reason, oh no. For some reason, Brad looked up and just left it there. And it could easily have been a try to Samoa. We're going to extra time. They can't be split. We're going for extra moments. Guys all over the park on their knees. They've given everything and it's got crucial moments. And it's brutalizing stuff. 23 tackles from Samoa, only three from South Africa. And that man, Salvin Davis, he can't take it anymore. Cover his eyes. Okay. He thought it was tough representing. Heads and tails, please. Tails is the call. Tails it is. Okay. Uh, we're receiving. Okay. What direction would you like to run? Um, we'd like to run in that direction. Okay.
that. So you'll some old kick right to left. Okay. Yep. Oh, Chris Wright, take me inside the mind of the locals here as a guy who's played in front of them. Yeah, it's tough, tough call to make. Do you receive? Do you, do you kick? But the call's been made. They want to receive. They want the ball. They want to build up an attack. But look how motivated the Samoan team is. And Bobo giving his orders. And what matchups we've seen today. The winner here going on to face New Zealand for the top prize in Cape Town. It was Samoa who led by seven at the break. Their try coming through Upper Sua. Ryan Ustaisen with a couple to play. Jammed one in for South Africa to make it 7-7. Seven, seven. Continue to run in the same direction they did in the second half. Will the blitz box? They will receive the start to extra time. You know, a slight breeze behind their backs, and I think that's a better decision. You look at the lineup, they've got three pods in front, one on the side. Miller de Plessis, all on the end. They want to avoid that contest at all costs. Samoa is so, so good at the kickoffs. Late, late switch in terms of replacements with Shin Fung Bait going back on the field, okay. Into extra time we head in our second cup semi-final. Samoa, the underdogs, sending this restart high. It's well waited a loss. This might be a penalty. No. It is now. Offside. And Samoa having a look at the posts. Felt like he came behind the ball. It's a tough decision. Big call to make. What are we doing? Okay. They will try and snap a shot. Okay. It's into the breeze here. It's into the breeze. And it's Fala Nico. Looking to put his team You've got 15 seconds now. into their first cup final since Vegas 2019. Final to become the hero for Samoa. Falanico, Falanico, it's good! And just like that, it's a walk-off penalty goal for Samoa. Just see the excitement of the Samoan team, what it needs him. You put the home crowd quiet. And it's a big, big win for the Samoan team. Over the blitz block that comes so far. You see what it means to him. It's tears and joy all around. And in the contrast, the blitz box who have to settle for third fourth playoff. The Blitz Box can't believe it. Not many can around the stadium in Cape Town. And Fatboy Falaniko, it never looks like missing. Get there, get there, get there, guys. It's good. Well, something special in the air around this tournament, always. And these two sides have served up some real class in case of the young champions, New Zealand women and some more men. Okay, let's 